everybody. Today is Wednesday. Yeah. Hope everybody had a great Thanksgiving. I mean, Thanksgiving. Boy, am I way off. <laughs> Valentine's Day. Hope you had a great Valentine's Day. I just got home and Samson is just giving me all kinds of kisses. But, uh, yeah, I had a great one. Ray got me some beautiful flowers and I cooked him a steak. So it was nice, but uh, I just wanted to check in with everybody. Um, not a whole lot of anything different going on. Just the same, still working and trying to just do the best I can, especially on the weekends. And uh, we're back to working on Saturdays. I didn't this week because I have my infusion, but we have been working on Saturdays. And that's really rough. But uh, other than that, just the same old thing, you know, trying to get by. And uh, this is, I think this is my fourth week of going into eating, going back to eating my salads at night. I mean, I guess you really have to just love salads and vegetables like I do to just eat it every night. Like I said, last night we had the steak, but we did have a salad with it. And I ate maybe this much of the steak and uh, a sweet potato because sweet potatoes are good for you. He had a baked potato. I had a baked sweet potato. And, uh, but this is my fourth week or more of having salad every night. What I do is on Sunday we get, uh, I get everything for my salad. And mine, I don't like tomatoes in which the acid is not good for lupus anyway. But my salad is just about completely green. It's lettuce, cucumber, broccoli, spinach. Mm, yeah. And then those uh, little mandarin oranges you get in a cup. Uh, I drain it and I put the oranges in there. And then Tyson chicken is the only chicken that I'll buy because it's not supposed to have any antibodies or uh, growth hormones or anything. So you can buy the already cooked chicken strips in the freezer bag they're really really good and I can just put a few of those in there to have a, some kind of protein yeah I really don't get burnt out on salads I just got away from eating good and I can tell I mean I really can't tell it makes me miserable uh, so that's what I have at night and uh, for lunch during the day I have um, turkey sandwich and for breakfast it's always hardy's can't help it you know what do you do when you get up at four o'clock in the morning i'm not hungry but on the way to work i have to get something to eat because i have to take all my medicines so i get hardy so in the morning it usually is a steak and biscuit from hardy's but let's see other than that yeah oh doing a lot better since I've started back my salads and filling. It does tell. The thing I can't get past, I know sugar is really bad for us, and I love my chocolate and stuff. Uh, if I have it here at the house, I will eat it. But sometimes the cravings, <laughs> it just won't quit. Sometimes the cravings are so bad, so what I do is I have like the little tiny Reese cups or whatever. And I can eat two or three of them because I don't start craving them until after supper. And it's like, really, you want to eat a salad and then you want to eat chocolate. I know, but... So if I just eat a little bit, then I'm good. Uh, but yeah, that's what I usually do. Today I took a banana and some crackers for lunch. And... uh. Of course, my green smoothies, and then uh, the turmeric, um, the turmeric capsules that I take really, really do help. They're not going to completely do away with your pain, 
but they are just so good for you. If you'll just look it up and see everything that they're really good for, and they do help my pain, especially. They help me when, at that times when I feel like I've got the flu, you know, just feel so achy and bad. And uh, then the magnesium for my legs. My legs for the last few months have been giving me the worst trouble. It's more than restless legs. It's shooting pains and cramping that's unreal. So I've been taking more magnesium trying to get that under control. My doctor even recommended it last week when I went. And I was really glad to hear him recommend that, as a matter of fact, instead of another pill. And, uh, but yeah, that's basically about it. Just, uh, got just about everything in the house done, all the painting just about done and staining the cabinets with the help of my girlfriend and my husband. And so, I can't really think of anything else. Oops dog hears a car but I just want to tell everybody hi and I love you and I'll talk to you later bye